welcome and or welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be reviewing this wig that i have on my head right now <laughs> this wig i got from ywigs.com it's a 360 lace frontal 18 inches peruvian straight uh i don't remember the density but it's the one that didn't cost any extra money medium brown cap color I think it's a natural black color I don't remember i got this wig way back in august i'll put all the specs down below this wig on my head right now was under 150 dollars so i actually filmed this review before back like in august but i never posted it so i'll show you guys clips from that video so y'all can see like how it initially looked so i bought it beginning of the semester semester has ended now it is almost january it's like 2017's already over this is like the wig i wear every single day i really don't do anything to it i know it looks kind of crazy but honestly i don't have time to be doing my hair every day i just get up and go i never glue down my wigs or anything so this wig comes fully constructed it has three combs i believe two on the side one in the back i got it in a free part so you can part it anywhere right now it's parted actually in the middle but i just i was too lazy to change the part so I just shifted it over to the side. So now the combs are a little off, but that's okay. It still fits comfortably. I sewed an elastic band on. My elastic band's a little too loose. If I tightened it, the wig would fit a little bit better. The only real complaint I have about this wig is it's kind of thin. <sighs> it's really thin and i mean obviously you can purchase a higher density so that's not really an issue i've had this wig since august i could still probably use it all next semester if i wanted to cheap like i said i don't glue on my wigs or anything i just plop it on and go i am gonna straighten so you can see like, how straight it can get um ignore how greasy this wig is i do need to like actually shampoo it i think i have some dry shampoo this is for light hair <laughs> is a little gray but you know what that's okay it will brush out eventually and the rest of my hair is a little greasy but again that's okay so y'all are just gonna have to ignore that i don't have any complaints or issues really it was just the density i can't even tell that this hair is thin i kind of like wearing it like this i look crazy i look crazy like i feel like i told y'all everything i needed to tell y'all so i'm just gonna go ahead and straighten the hair and So that's as straight as I'm going to get it. Y'all can probably tell I do not straighten hair because that was seriously a struggle. I wanted to straighten this hair like bone straight. I would take the wig off and do it on a mannequin head. Like I mentioned earlier, this is actually parted in the middle and I just shifted it to the side. I am going to insert a picture of what my hair looked like parted in the middle. Everyone has been telling me that my hair looks better in a middle part, but y'all tell me. I don't think I have anything else to say about this wig. I'll leave all the links and information down below. Um, I did, again, purchase this back in August. It is almost January, and I wear this wig, like, every single day. If I do end up getting another straight wig, I will end up cutting this one and dyeing it blue. I'm gonna cut it, like, chin length. Y'all watch my videos, y'all know that I was wearing um, Bobby Boss's Copper. That's a synthetic wig, but I, like, chopped off so much of it, and it was chin length, and I, I just missed that haircut. Short, I feel like short hair looks better on me. I don't want to ramble on too long. I like to keep my videos pretty short. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe, all of that, and yeah. <laughs>